Here we join. Michael Joseph Sandel is one of my most favorite professors in the field of political philosophy, who gives us a profound theme that makes us thought-provoking. And he often throws a question of morality that, assuming that we happen to be involved in an extreme situation where we have a serious dilemma of whether we accept annihilation. Or we choose to make sacrifice of someone to save the rest of people. So the feature of his thought-provoking question is that morality is always taken as a hostage behind the cruel prioritization of things that brings us to make a heart-rending decision. So, like you offer a sacrifice, or you are all dead. So this is really nasty question. So the interesting point. Of his question is that there could be more than one answer depending on the sense of morality that people have. That his question has no one clear answer that anybody can convince. So the feature of his lecture is like trying to define morality in extreme unavoidable situation, where we face to accept sacrifice by discussing the best decision over morality. But I realized. That there is one thing in common about the discussion to find the best ethical decision against the question he asks. The members who fall into、uh, extreme situation, which he assumes don't sacrifice themselves as a premise. <clears throat> I mean, nobody will risk their lives to help the rest of people. So, in short, the concept of self-sacrifice. Is eliminated as a premise, so everyone wants to be saved. So how can we give a priority to the things in morality to choose someone for sacrifice to save me and others? So this is the this is the this is only the condition to lead an answer of morality against the question he asks to us. So for example, Mr. Sander gave a question of morality. By taking the case of Mignonette as an example, the case of Mignonette is the incident that survived crew members of the ship called Mignonette that shipwrecked on the way from England to Australia were charged with murder and cannibal, and five crews of ship members drifted in the middle of the sea by lifeboat. All food they had then. Were two canned turnips, and people driven by madness killed someone to quench their thirst and fill their stomach to survive while drifting in the sea. So, Mr. Sanders' question is simply: What is the best moral behavior for people to survive from this situation? Answer of answer of. Students were all permissive to making a sacrifice of someone to survive from this situation. So, but they didn't have the thought of self-sacrifice, even though most of them seemed to believe in Christ. So, aside from the viewpoint of whether we can do it or not, self-sacrifice is one big moral solution when we confront the extreme situation that we must choose someone for sacrifice. To save the rest of people.